Howdy friends, howdy. Tony here with you. Glad to be with you. Some of my uh, followers here on uh, YouTube have expressed interest in this whole song, this whole spiritual or sometimes referred to as a folk song, Wayfaring Stranger. What I'm going to do here today is show you the chord technique and some pull-offs and strumming pattern and I'm going to break it down real easy where you can learn this old song. And it's played in the A minor. And I suggest to get a chord book if you don't already have one. We're going to break it down slow and do it real slow and easy for you so you can kind of grasp what we're doing. And I'm going to show you the chord patterns and the strumming pattern. And it's played in the A minor and the chords that will be also used in this tutorial will be, of course, the A minor, then the D minor, the F, the C, and the E7. We're going to start real easy. We're going to do a simple one-two beat. We're going to be starting on that number five string down to the number four. One, two, one. And that little pull-off there is done with the middle finger. And it's on that number four string that you make the minor chord. I'm on just a poor wayfaring stranger Traveling through, there's your D minor right there. This where some land back to the A minor. There'll be no sickness, toil or danger in that bright land D minor to which I go back to A minor. Now we're going into the course and we'll start right into F. I'm going there to meet my Savior to see now. Going there back to F. No more to run. And that's that E7. I'm just going. Hear the pull off over Jordan. I'm just going at your D minor over home. See what I'm doing? One, two, one. And you get that pick in hand, you just get it real limber and grasp your pick the way you should. And remember, the heavier pick you got, the more volume you get. The lighter pick, you get more flexibility. I like about a medium gauge. Let's go with it one more time, starting in the A minor. And remember that pull off is right there at that number four string. When you make that A minor, that kind of adds a sound effect to it, if you will. Here we go. I'm just a poor, wayfaring stranger. Traveling through D minor, this world of woe back to A minor. There'll be no sickness, toil, or danger in that bright world D minor to which I go A minor. Going to the course. Going there, that's your F, to see my Savior C. Going there, back to F, no more to roam. There's that E7, or E major. I'm just going either way over Jordan. I'm just going at your D minor over home. And you can go to the sixth string and do this right. One, two, three, go right into your A minor. I'm going down. My Savior, go in there, no more to run. Ours will pull off in the E chord from the number five string, second fret. I'm just going over Jordan. Hear the pull off, just going over home. And this bass run off of that. Uh, uh, number six string, third fret. Over home, over home. Right to the A, A minor chord. It's pretty simple. 
I'm just a poor wayfaring stranger traveling through the D minor world of woe There'll be no sickness or danger In that bright world a D minor to which I go Going to the course in F Going there to meet my Savior in the sea there Going there back to F No more to roam There's your E or E7 I'm just I'm just going over Jordan I'm just going over home And like I said folks, get you a chord book It's essential to have a chord book and a good tuner to keep that guitar tuned and standard Just a poor wayfaring stranger Traveling through this world of woe Be no sickness, toil or danger In that bright world to which I go Go in there to meet my Savior Go in there no more than wrong And when you hit that E seven just take that middle finger and hammer on and off and gives it that sound effect you're looking for now I'm gonna give you another version of the same song like I say some of the older folks called it wayfaring a pilgrim and they used a G instead of a D minor they played it in A minor but they would use a G let me give you a little a little sample of what they done I'm just a poor wayfaring stranger traveling through. That's a G major there. This world of woe. Be no sickness, toil or danger to that bright little world. Instead of using the D minor, they would use the G major. But the course was the same. Go in there to meet my mother. Oh, she said she'd meet me when I come. I'm just going over Jordan. I'm just going over home. Like I say, the old version, they would use the G instead of the D minor. I like it both ways, and I'm sure you'll take a liking to it. Let me break it down one more time, real slow and easy. I'm just a poor, wayfaring stranger, traveling through the D minor, this world of wool back to the A minor. Be no sickness, toil or danger In that bright world, D minor, to which I go We're going to the course now, F Go in there to meet my Savior As you see, back to F Go in there, no more to E Back to A minor, I'm just going over Jordan. I'm just going over home. Another little trick, uh, if you want to make, uh, have a very sweet sound effect, was when you make your D minor, you can on and off with your index. That's just a pull off of the D minor. Same way with the A minor if you want to use the index finger to pull on and off. Gives you a different sound effect. But anyway, I hope you've picked up something with the Wayfaring Stranger or Wayfaring Pilgrim, whichever, uh, that I've uh, rendered forth to you here today. Some people had requested 
And but this is the very simple way to do it, just the old common one two strum, one two beat. <laughs> Put it all together by using that method and technique. Chords, rhythm, rhythm melody, chord melody, and, and it'll all come together for you. Just take your time with it. Like I said, get you a chord book, make sure you're in tune, and take your time. There's a lot of good people that's got a tutorial on this song, and I'm sure you'll pick up something from some of us. God bless, take care, and I'll catch them up with you later. Bye-bye.